Welcome followers of the channel. This is Phil Beck with your professional painter and decorator. Back with an update on um, the flat refurbishment. Now, um, yeah, what shall I say about that? Slowly but surely we're getting there. Now, some of you might know we had a little bit of an incident family-wise um, back end of last year. My youngest son ended up in um, QMC that's um, Queen's Medical Centre, Nottingham. Um, very touch and go. He had the invasive strep A. Now, I don't want to go into that, but he's fine now. So those of you that know me through other channels have asked how he was, he's fine. You won't think there's anything been wrong with him. But for those that don't know, over two litres of fluid came off his lungs um, very poorly. And um, for a nine-year-old, very upsetting for the family and close friends. That, by the by, we're not dwelling on that now. We're getting back on we're getting back on the flat refurb so i'm not blaming him for being ill far from it but it did hold us up over the period of time when i was off over the christmas period so we're back into 2023 um now so we're getting on it where are we with it yeah right we talk about the kitchen i'm going to spin around and show you how we are with the kitchen da, da, da. you know i like doing the da, da, da. this is the kitchen can you see? Let's see if we can get you on a wide angle. Yeah, there we go, that's better. We're on a wide angle. We made the decision we are going to have a new kitchen. Uh, did think about painting it and refurbishing it. Refurbishing it. We're having a new kitchen, yeah. We'll, we'll spend the money. Um, my plumber has been in uh, recently. It's just disconnected all the waste for the sink, um, the washing machine disconnected the gas uh, we've just got to disconnect the power which is dead easy because it's only on a plug for the oven um, the hob we'll just unscrew and lift out so that's straightforward that is work in progress yeah we've got a design of the kitchen which really resembles what is already there but it'll be a nice kitchen um, we'll have new units a bit more modern the worktops will have the same matching uprising, you know, that's quite fashionable at the moment, to um, match in there, and yeah, work in progress. Do you wanna see what the bathroom's like? Yeah, I'm glad this isn't smelly vision, because all I'm gonna say is, I can smell things. I'm back, let's just have a look at the bathroom. Just get inside. Well, I've been doing a bit, even though it's not been me doing it. Let's get you up in the top. Bath's out, tiles are off because they fell off the wall. I'm in need of that being chopped off, all the plasterboard coming off, and um, we're going to resort that. The toilet's in at the moment, it's all disconnected. That's what we can smell because we've got, well, I'm not saying open drains, but you know what I mean? You know when you've got pipes that aren't connected to anything particular like that. You can see that probably the waste off the um bath we're getting a bit of smell from the soil pipes but toilets coming out sometime soon we can get on here um thankfully my brother-in-law's a plasterer so he's going to sort out this back wall and where the tiles are we're going to get those off see if it needs plastering plastering and boarding which it probably will do and we'll start from there so you can guess we're having a new bathroom um we're currently debating whether we go for an l-shaped bath or a standard 70, is it 1700 by seven stroke 800 or we'll go for a little bit of a slight cubicle on that L shaped. So uh, there's not much in it in price, but we're just gonna have a, a second measure to see where we are, are with fitting it in. Particularly, we've not got a lot of room between that um, frame and the corner. So we'll see what we can do. So that's where we are. We're gonna get a new bathroom in. We're gonna get a new kitchen in. And we're moving forward. I'm quite happy with that. Um, the plans are, I'm going to start in the bedroom. So quite possibly after this video, the next one will be a quick whiz of painting the bedroom out. Because that's not a difficult one to do. I can show you how to do that. Because if you remember from the first video, it's vinyl silk. I know. We're going to keep it simple in there. It's white woodwork. I'm going to go for white woodwork all the way through to make it fresh and clean. Um, I'm also going to be using paints that I got in my workshop um, to use some stuff up to as clear as clear as a bit of space. 
Now, if you're a supplier of paint or somebody wants to send me something out to try, give us a shout. I'm always open to trying stuff out. Porsche, you listening? I joke about my Porsche, don't I? I want a Porsche. As and when. My wife says I can have a Porsche if I sell a couple of things. And I looked at the kids and I thought, no, I won't get enough for those. So, it's on the cards. Um, just something I'm toying with. This back wall behind me. I've got a plan for that. I've got a plan. And it involves gold leaf. Watch this space. So, um, yeah, we're keeping this uh, quick, simple video. It's under 10 minutes, which you'll like, and um, we're moving forward. So, um, I'll see you on the next one. Kitchen, oh, I know. There's some videos coming up there, hopefully. Some videos there.